good morning welcome to yet another glorious day the day that the lord has made let us exceedingly be glad in it is a wonderful day and the day are the works of our mighty god the ever-present god in time of need the Holy One of Israel, the true God, the great ocean divider, the Ayan that I am, the God that was, the God that is, is, and the God that will still come, the God that is ancient, the God that is present, the God that is also the future. This morning, by the grace of God, I am here to share a daily exhortation with you. My name is Joshua Osatoame, and I'm here to share this morning exhortation with you. Let us pray. Our Father, we thank you for your great work. How you disappoint the enemy during the night. This morning we are strong, heal and head. Glory be to God. Even as we, your children, hear your word, bless our hearts, bless our soul. Make us to know wisdom. Make us to know your way. Lead us in the path that will bring about change in our life. Let us go closer to you and serve you. And give us victory on everything we partake on today. On every good work that we involve ourselves in today. Bless us, transform us, and make us just like you. In Jesus' perfect name, we pray. Amen. This morning we'll be looking at a topic titled Success Without Suffering. Philippians 1 25. For unto you giving in the behalf of Christ, not only to believe in him, but also suffer for his sake. Success without suffer. We can find comfort in the midst of money. Because God can use our suffering to teach us and make us better people. Sometimes it takes suffering to make us realize the brevity of life and the importance of living for Christ. Often God uses suffering to accomplish things in our life that would otherwise never be achieved. The Bible put it succinctly, count it all joy, my brethren, when you meet various trials, for you know that the testing of your faith produces steadfastness, and let steadfastness have its full effect, that ye may be perfect and complete lacking in nothing James 1 2 4 some of the godliest people I have ever known were men and women who have been called upon to endure great suffering and yet because they knew Christ and walk in the joy of his presence every day God blessed them and turned them into people who reflected Christ often I have gone into sick room or hospital room to encourage someone who have left feeling. I was the one who had been encouraged and helped because God had used his trials to make me more like Christ. Before the power of the actor was discovered, science has to devise a way to smash the actor. The secret of the actor immeasurable and limitless power was in it being crushed. Dr. Edward Johnson, at the dedication of the Johnson Memorial Church, 
in you, New York City said, suffering and success go together. If you are succeeding without suffering, it is because order before you have suffered. If you are suffering without succeeding, it is that others after you may succeed. Let us pray. Our Father and our God, your suffering is often difficult for me to understand at the time, but I know it will eventually make me into a better person. Help me to bear up during the trials patiently, knowing I will gain spiritual health and wisdom as you, as you walk through it all. In the name of the Savior, I pray. Amen. And the Lord bless this word in our hearts. In Jesus' name. Don't forget to join me tomorrow for another exhortation like this. I remember humble self to show us at one. Till then, stay blessed and stay safe.